what is going on guys so i've had a real hard time trying to figure out a wheel that i want to go with on the focus st and uh, so i've been researching looking searching marketplace uh, forums things like that and a lot of people run the same wheels and there's not a whole lot of choices on these cars so today i actually found some on facebook marketplace that i think i'm gonna pull the trigger on uh, there's a catch to them though. I'll show you that later. But anyways guys, we're on the road. We're heading there. I'll keep you updated. All right, it was a super cool dude. I met that guy off of a local forum that I'm a part of, but the wheels are back here. Let's get home and I'll show you what's up and I'll show you the catch to these wheels. All right guys, we just made it home. I'm about to unload these and I'll show you all what these are and what I have to do to get them road ready. All right, guys, we picked up some Ray's Wheels Graham lights. And guys, I've always loved the way these wheels looked. So they are dirty, they need to be cleaned up. Um, brand new tires, believe it or not, two months old. So the reason the guy sell, sold these and he's not running them on his focus anymore, he hit a nasty pothole. And guys, all of these, these are in really good shape. Like I said, they're dirty and need to be cleaned. Very light wheel rash in some places, but I'm getting all that fixed. So the reason he quit running these right here, he hit a nasty pothole and bent this rim. So it's kind of bad. I did get these for a really good price though. And uh, my friend Connor, he already hooked me up with a guy that does wheel repairs. And uh, so at the beginning of the year, I'm gonna get these fixed. And after I get them fixed, I'm gonna get them dismounted from the tires. And I'm gonna get these powder coated and I'm not going to tell you what color yet. Comment down below what color you think I'm going to get these powder coated. So I'm really excited because I've been wanting wheels for the Focus for a while. And uh, yeah, I just haven't been able to uh, decide on anything. So like I said, guys, I was really excited. Uh, fun fact. I almost bought Graham lights for my blue Civic Si, so super pumped for these guys. All right, I might roll two over there for fun. All right, guys, I got these stacked up. I did kind of sort of clean one just to see how good they clean up. Man, guys, these look absolutely incredible. A little bit of road rash right here. But like I said, I'm gonna get this touched up and I'm gonna get these powder coated. Man, them look good. It's not a game, it's a red stick. All right, guys, I can't remember exactly where we left off last clip. That had been a couple weeks ago uh, with the holidays and the bad weather and snow. Uh, it's put my wheel project behind, but since last clip, I have found, let me see here. This one's okay. I wanted to show you all something on one. So we already know one's bent. I have to get it fixed. Yeah, I think these two are fine. Yeah, so th this here's the bent wheel bent up pretty bad right there and then there's one yeah right here guys it's very unfortunate and i don't even think the guy I bought these from new but there is a slight crack right there where i have it high outlined with marker so today we're leaving the cracked wheel and the bent wheel behind. So today I'm going to a very special place to get these took off. Guys, I'm gonna take you along with me. I was gonna get these tires took off of these wheels, 
but the gentleman repairing these wheels wants the tires with them so when he's done fixing them he can make sure they hold air but guys for now i'm gonna get the tires off of these guys let's get to the shop that's gonna take these off for us today all right guys let's get these loaded up so we are going to lewisport kentucky today and guys, if you can guess where we're going, go ahead and comment it down in, in the comments. Got the two loaded up. So guys, let's get on the road. I wanted to make a comment real quick while I'm heading down here. I got uh, quite the drive to get here uh, to the shop we're going to today. But I knew going in that these wheels needed a lot of help. And uh, I didn't mind because I got them at such a good price point that even if I had to repair two or three of them, uh, I'm still gonna be sitting in these way better than if I bought them brand new. Especially after I get them powder coated and stuff, guys, these are gonna look brand new. So no, I'm not mad or in any way, shape or form that uh, I did find a crack in another one of those wheels. Um, me and a good friend, we went through the wheels with a fine tooth comb after I cleaned them uh, this weekend. And uh, we found that crack, but other than that, that's all we found. No cracks on the outside or, you know, on the face of the wheel. So everything's good there. Uh, you know, I, I was a little bummed when I found the crack, but you know, I knew going in that uh, these wheels needed some love. And uh, you know, we love a good project here at Brian Lewis Vlog. Sorry guys, I'll see you when we get to the shop. Welcome back, Steven. What up? Tell them where we're at today. Uh, we're at Regal Motorsports, my new home. So. Guys, you know that I'm not at the car dealership anymore. I don't have access to things like I used to, so you know I don't trust anybody, uh, just anybody. So we had to drive a little distance to uh, come see my man today. Yeah, get Brian hooked up on these wheels, get these tires off here for him, so. I just showed him the crack we found. Okay. And, uh, but let him know that I'm in them so good that it don't matter if I had to repair a couple of them or not, so. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, stack. Uh, Steven's got a pretty good setup here now. Yeah, working for Regal. We've got some Porsche race cars that we support. Um, and then, uh, I mean, the everyday work. Like, we got a 350Z here with a turbo kit. We need some work. Got a Corvette on the back dyno. We do have an in house dyno, all wheel drive dyno that we use. So, it's quite the change from uh, dealership life. Guys, if you're anywhere near the Lewisport uh, area, Lewisport, Kentucky, uh, look them up, Regal Motorsports. Uh, if you need anything, holler at Steven. Yeah. All right, today all we are doing is just dismounting the tires off of these two wheels. Like I said, the dude wanted those tires on the other wheels. So, flip the camera around here and this tire machine is uh, a lot more advanced than I'm used to. Yeah, it's not a bad one. It's got the auto takeoff feature, but I won't be using that. Or I don't plan on using it. Auto takeoff. Does it put them on automatically? Uh, it's like, yes, like, kind of. It's a little bit of assistance. All right, huge shout out to Steven for getting these two tires off for me. Guys, if any of you are wondering, these wheels are 18 by eight and a half with a 38 offset. And as far as tire, uh, my Yokohamas on my uh, stock wheels are 235, 4018. These are 245, 4018. And I think I'm gonna run the bigger tire um, I think it's going to fill up the fender well just a little bit more and they're a little bit wider I think it'll just make the car look better and I am going to lower the car 
Uh, I d haven't showed you all yet, but I have test fitted these on the car. I will show you that in the reveal video uh, after the car or after the wheels are on the car. Uh, I just didn't want to want to keep that as a surprise for now. But I was wanting, really wanting my Yokohama tires because they're a lot better brand than these West Lakes. But these West Lakes are brand new. And they're not very old and like i said they are i think these are going to fill up the fender well just a little bit more but huge shout out to steven for taking these off for us he's also going to mount them and stuff after i get these uh, cleaned up and get them powder coated and get those other two fixed but for now to end today's video we have a special surprise for you sneak peek to something steven's going to be working on on his youtube channel guys Go subscribe to his channel, S Squared Customs. Steven, let's show these guys the little project you're going to be working on your channel. And guys, you get a sneak peek right here on a brownless well, vlog. I mean, we got a stack of parts over here. And the car is a 2005 Corvette. So let's go back to the dyno and I'll show you on the dyno what we got. Today, I'm gonna to be doing some preliminary pulls on this 2005 Corvette. Uh, basically, the guy came in and we are gonna end up doing a supercharger and camshaft, uh, exhaust, full exhaust, so a pretty good build. And we wanted to get some baseline numbers before we actually done any work to the car. So that's what we're gonna to do today, get a couple pulls on the dyno here, get some numbers and uh, see what it does stock. Right now it is 100% stock car, so it's probably not going to be impressive numbers, but it's still going to be something cool. So, yeah. So stick to my channel and you'll hopefully see the finished build. All right, guys. What do you think about the Ray Graham lights I picked up for the Focus ST? Comment down below. They do need a little love, but I will get them there. Cannot wait to show you all the final results when they're done. Huge shout out to Steven. It's been a while since we filmed together, so this is was a breath of fresh air. I told you in a few vlogs ago I really miss filming with Steven. Huge shout out to Steven and Regal Motorsports. Thank you so much for taking my tires off my rims today. They will be the ones mounting my tires whenever I get my new, or uh, whenever I get the raised wheels powder coated. So we will be back here. But guys, for now, that's where I'm with today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, guys. Make sure if you want to see more of that Corvette to go subscribe to Steven's channel, uh, S Squared Customs. I'll link all that in the description box below. Check out all the Amazon affiliate links. Guys, if you need parts, visit www.panamotorworks.com. Use code BLEWIS, save yourself some money. Also, if you need any LED bulbs for any vehicle, make or model, visit Oxido's website, linked in the description box below. Use code Brian Lewis, save 15% off of everything on the website. Also, check out Yida Motors floor mats. I haven't checked out any of their other stuff yet, but their floor mats are incredible. They will be linked in the description box as well. Guys, until next time. <laughs>